Assalamu alaikum to all of you friends welcome to another new video from Trek Brethren. In today's video we will share 9 coolest bicycles that you will want to ride. So let's begin the show. Number 9. Reno Bike What is Reno? Well, it's less than a motorcycle. But in other ways, it's so much more. One wheeled electric powered. A machine that has no greater footprint than you do, capable of operating speeds up to 10 miles per hour, or as slowly as a casual stroll. The Reno is transformation, humanized, the first personal mobility device that will to connect you to people, not take you away from them. The Reno lets you mix and mingle into a crowd naturally. A balanced machine. Reno relies on the same balance technology as other electronically stabilized products like remote control helicopters, jet planes and space and space ships. The technology uses the combination of the accelerometer sensor that knows where the center of the earth is, a gyroscopic sensor that is highly reactive to sensing T tangents and a set of motors to drive the wheel back and forth under the center of gravity. As the bike leans forward, the motors drive the wheel under the rider to keep the bike in balance. To accelerate the rider, simply push down on the handlebars with enough force to prevent the tilt angle from coming back to zero. The more the rider works to keep the handlebars from coming up. The harder the motors drive to counter that force, side to side the Rena steers like a conventional motorcycle for balance. Number 8. XTND Board The XTND Board is the best electric skateboard you have ever seen. And the prototype display at TechCrunz show everyone is agree. The silk board is handcrafted from carbon fiber, titanium and space grab materials using 200 high quality engineers, engineered parts that were all designed from the group up. That's reason enough to buy it if you just want a stack board. But the tech is what takes XTND to the next level. Artificial intelligence that adapts the board to your specific riding style. In wheel generative motors that recharge your battery while costing downhill or braking. Built in automatic lights for safe riding in the dark. It weighs less than 7 pounds. It has a range of over 12 miles and can be reached in an hour. It can hit a top speed just say of 30 mm per hour and it rated for a 20% hill climb. It's an electric board field with tech that still has a slick profile and clean lines. Number 7. Sea Bracer If you go down to Victoria Docks in central London, you could well meet the Sea Bracer. The Sea Bracer is like no watercraft you will ever have seen. The Sea Bracer is like no other watercraft you will ever have seen. It looks like some of submarine. It moves in the water like a dolphin. It's piloted like a plane and thanks to Intot Blue. You can ride in one. In sense, the sea bracer is semi-submersible vessel. But what makes it unlike any other boat is the fact that it can power along the surface of the water and then drive below surface. Plunging up to 2 meters, it can then branch out of the water again just like a whale shark or a dolphin can, hence the name. Number 6. Polaris Singshot Singshot is a 3-wheel open-air roadster that allows you to experience the world in a whole new way. Not a motorcycle nor a convertible, feel the rush of the road below and sky above the while stealing barely 5 inches above the ground. 
no roof, no doors, one glance and then a double take. All eyes will be on you. The slingshot looks, sounds and drive likes nothing else on the road today. Each one is as unique as its driver, serving as the ultimate platform for self-expression and creativity. But one thing is always included, the instant, indescribable and magnetic effort that it brings. Now offered with a sportly 5-speed manual transmission or an, or an initiate auto drive transmission, making your drive automatic with no clothing or manual shifting. With the addition of Fadel Swifter, you can truly make your ride your own. Number 5. Electrum Light Electric Vehicle the Electrum is an e-bike that has been designed from the ground up to offer as many of the convenience of an automobile as possible while still legally remaining a bicycle. It can carry 100 liters of cargo or a small passenger. The Electrum has offered some weather protection for the riders as well as all of the lighters and the turn signals you would expect to find on a motorcycle. At the heart of the Electrum is the generator and chain drive which allows the rider to pedal at a constant speed without having to shift any complicated bicycle gears. At just 24 inch wide, the Electrum can easily slip past stall traffic like a bicycle and when you arrive at your destination, you can park it anywhere you can park a bicycle. Number 4 Mimo C1 Mimo C1 features a customizable font cargo space that takes up to 70 kg of additional load and a quick floating mechanism. On the go, battery swimming allows Mimo C1 user to commute longer and further, smaller than a bicycle. Mimo C1 is easier to handle and more affordable than cargo bicycle. What makes Mimo C1 unique is the practical combination of the mobility of an e-scooter and the combination of a push trolley so users will never have to leave the mobility device to make a collection or delivery. Mimo C1 is an all-in-one solution for fast to last mile delivery. Number 3. Athos Flat by Pedal Quad if you funky, swagway, powered central, show in your recent look at dual mode transportation, is still too powerful and heavy for you. It may be time to go Athos, short of an unnatural cross between a pedal powered bicycle and four wheel quad. This barely extreme quad cycle aims to go rider a new option of road travel that blends BMX. Motocross and downhill biking, according to its builder contents, engineering, the Athos combines the stabling and handling of a quad with the flexibility of a bicycle. We are not sure how cons defines flexibility but we really don't see a wide track four wheel cycle being equal to a bicycle in that department. Unlike the Sway and Blade three wheelers, the Athos wheels do not teeth. So the turning radius has to be somewhat large and clunky when compared to bike. However, we can dig the combination of a quad footprint and lighter motorless frame. Number 2. Lazaret Amphibi The MOOC Amphibi by Lazaret lets people drive on land or water in 9060bis boggy. Created by Domic Lazaret, the French car and motorcycle trainer behind the back to the Fusar Yamaha YZF-R1. He is known for blurring the generous of bicycle and producing some of the most outrageous comes in Europe. It Lazaret Mook MVV all aluminium bicycle features a small 400cc Euro 4 engine capable of driving. The cult classic car of 90 km per hour within just a few seconds, it can drive into occasion or lakes that set sail, where a proper will drive the mini mode through water at 7 knots.
and the last number one electric rolls royals phantom v and electric rolls royals phantom v is the definition of refitment electric gun version is specialized lance has unflipped its battery powered version of the phantom v one of the artificial railways it promises 300 miles of range and lots of modern features but it ain't cheap there are few trailer cars than Roll Royce Phantom V. After all, it was a car of size of both John Lennon and the Queen, plus plenty of politicians and governors. It was organically powered by a 6.2 liter V8 mated to a 4 speed auto. But the one you see here has a totally different, slightly more modern powertrain. Okay so thanks for watching, if you like the video please like, comment, share and subscribe now this tech channel. So see you next time, bye.